All right, friends, let's get back into this. This is where we left off the other day. Let's carry on. See that maple? It ain't hurting nothing.
So that's a good looking stem. Um, I nicked this little guy here. Just started to nick him right there, little teeny bit. Here's our, here's our work. Pretty much what they're looking for. That's my walk log out of here. See that? That's how I get out of here now. I didn't want to lay it down there. I wanted it out there so that when it's time to leave, I can walk that out. Friends, watch how I enter my back cut here. Watch where I enter from, right up close to my holding wood. Not straight in the back. I come in on an angle so that I can fit a wedge in there on an angle and set, get control of my tree without being on the back of my bar. Watch how I do this, watch.
Friends, if I pounded that wedge straight in, I'd be on my bar in a heartbeat. Seriously, and that's that funky wedge. So, friends, this one here, uh, as you'll notice, I'm just gonna play it, play it outright, like live. It, it's a bang. It's covered. You can actually see by the by the stem that six or eight feet of stem standing there that it's leaning back. Um, I'll show you some stuff on on entering your with your back cut when it comes to not having a, a lot of wood to play around with your wedges before you're up against your bar. Coming up tomorrow's video, be the last video on, on this job. There's one more after after today, and that's it. But um, you can see with the wedging that's going on here, it becomes a problem. This tree a little bit, no, not a problem, just a just a hard bang. That's all. So, you can see what we were dealing with. It was completely hung and it had to be banged out of there hard. And we're leaving it full. There's our stump. Great looking stump. A little bit of root rot, but we're, we're leaving it full length because there's like a drainage ditch from up the pond there. So, we'll go get two more right there. That one looks like it's leaning back too. Let's go get those. Remember that? You know, friends, I used to do this style of work day in, day out, just going. For hundreds and hundreds of days, like just going, going, going. So people ask me, Bucket, how do you get your cuts to line up? So friends, I've made, I couldn't even imagine. I couldn't even put a silly number on how many of those things I've made. <laughs> and that's what'll happen for you too. If you want to get better at it, there, there's no special trick. I, I don't, I've seen guys try to explain it to people and I'm like, well, what happens if you just turn it like that? What's going to do? Say, just, it's just doing it. It's just doing it. So anyway, friends, there's one, two, three, I think three or four more trees. It'll be another video, which is, just over there and it's a little bit funky one more big one a couple others so we'll split that up into another video um i'm getting feedback that these are these videos help 
folks. The half an hour ones are long for some people and everybody can handle a 15 minute video. So that's kind of what we're doing through this. Um, yeah, having a blast. Anyways, and I got a nice climbing video coming up. Lots of stuff. Got my part in for my, for my ax. You know, the eye for putting the eye in for the, we're going to go put that in this weekend, I think. Yeah. Anyways, friends, thanks for watching. Friends, work hard. Be honest. And for definitely sure, be kind to one another. Catch you on the next video. Thanks for watching. Give her a thumbs up.